Good morning, everyone. Yes, it's morning time. But then uh, after breakfast, uh, I wanted to cook a really big meal. The biggest meal ever I cooked. So what I'm going to cook is uh, chicken stew. It has been snowing and raining these days, and I thought chicken stew can be something uh, that I can have uh, several times so I'm making a big portion so here you can see one kilogram chicken breast and inner fillet mixed and to that I will use uh, as usual garlic ginger onion and red chili and then zucchini tomato and spring onion yes first thing first so because it will be requiring a little bit higher temperature. I'm going to mix this time, this uh, rap's oil, 50%. And then olive oil, 50%. Of course, olive oil is more nutritious, but when I fry chicken with high temperature, I think uh, I need some rap's oil. All right, first thing first. So I will put this uh, garlic, ginger, onion, and chili all in. So I put half garlic and seven onion and two big fresh chili. So as you can see that in the volume wise, uh, same amount of uh, meat. Uh, I have um, for vegetables so I'm using the biggest frying pan I have so everything has a space for that uh, as you can see I didn't uh, make a tiny pieces but more cubes a little bit bigger chunk so when this is a bit uh, yellow a little bit light brownish then i'm going to add the chicken now i'm going to open the door a bit fresh air when you cook so the ventilation is important wow the smell is so good whenever i cook garlic onion chili smells so good so now it's uh, a bit uh, yellowish so I'm going to add uh, chicken I think I need uh, <laughs> two hands the heavyweight one kilogram so it's all in but to that actually I will spray some Korean rice wine you know this uh, soju uh, because sometimes uh, chicken smell something a little bit not so good so I'm putting one big spoon of uh, soju rice wine into this so how are you coping with it it's winter time So, you know, cold places, cold part of the world, they eat a lot of meat and potato. But I do not have potato, so I'm, I'm going to put a lot of vegetables. That's why I have uh, tomato, zucchini, and lots of uh, onion instead.
I don't know if I can call this uh, pork stew, or no, chicken stew, or uh, stirred chicken. I could be more stirred chicken because this is not going to be that watery. So when this chicken is almost uh, half done, uh, I'm going to put the rest of the uh, vegetable. But for now, I think it's 20-30% uh, cooked. But when it is cooked to like 50-70%, uh, then I will add vegetable. Yeah, if we want to cook this very fast, you could make even tinier pieces of chicken. But I made a little bit uh, bigger chunk. So now I can see the chicken is uh, like 50% done. You can see the white, more white, more white than pink. So I'm going to add uh, these uh, vegetables. Uh, usually when I cook, it takes very short time, but Today it will be a little longer time because I'm uh, making double portion. One kilogram of chicken. So to make more energy efficiency, I'm going to cover it. So the biggest uh, frying pan and biggest lock I have. So I will just uh, let it cook. So what do you do for your winter sports? Uh, I mean, the best activity I like uh, during winter time, of course, is to ski. Uh, so far, I skied. Uh, uh, three times uh, but then I hope I can uh, ski more uh, the rest of the winter time but uh, even if it's snowing and or it, it's a lot of snow outside it's also nice to run because uh, the, the snowed road is very soft so it's very uh, gentle to my ankles and knees so so last night I uh, I ran even after sunset, but because of the snow, it was bright in the mountainside. But as soon as uh, I was running on the road, then it was quite dark. So I had in my flesh on my forehead, which is which was safer. Yeah, but of course, uh, uh, the other side of uh, uh, the globe uh, like New Zealand, Australia, Australia it's uh, summertime, right? So my German teacher, he's currently uh, in uh, New Zealand and uh, I mean, he he's retired so 
uh, with his wife. He's traveling on the bus in New Zealand and uh, he's sharing uh, what he's doing every day. So it's really nice. Um, over 30 gra grade, a degree, yeah. Yeah, but I enjoy the winter time. So the more juices are coming from the vegetables. So I will see I turn around how it looks. I can see there's some of the chicken is not cooked yet. But most of the chicken they cook, I can, I can feel the chicken is hard and it's white. But some of them are still uh, pinkish and a little bit soft. So for the safety, for the securing, uh, all the chicken is ready. So I'm going to put this uh, on the cover a little bit more. So when I feel like uh, all the chickens are cooked, then I'm going to actually use uh, uh, sesame, sesame oil, soy sauce, chili paste, and chili pepper powder, and black pepper. So this is the spices I'm going to use for this chicken. So basically, I mean, Korean food, I use a lot of soy sauce and chili paste because soy sauce is uh, salty and chili paste is uh, spicy and a little bit sweet. But then um, sesame oil, it has this deep smell and taste I like. Um, but then uh, I use also uh, extra chili pepper to add a more spiciness without adding more sweetness. Otherwise, it can be very sticky and sweet if I use too much chili paste. Yes, so I think it's uh, it's ready. I think um, chicken is uh, like uh, 90, 95%, 99% is ready. So I'm going to start with uh, soy sauce. I'm going to pour one big spoon of uh, soy sauce. And then I'm going to put one big spoon of chili paste and then I'm going to put sesame oil yeah one big spoon then I'm going to mix everything here with the the ingredients here. So while I'm missing, I'm going to check if all the chicken is cooked. 
verify that everything is hard and everything is whitish when it comes to chicken. Wow, it smells so good with the soy sauce and sesame oil. It looks good. I think all the chicken is uh, cooked. And I'm going to cover it one more time. so good so and this time when I feel like uh, everything is uh, ready then uh, I will actually turn off the fire and then uh, add uh, chili pepper and black pepper Yes, I think now it's uh, ready. So I turn it off. Then I mix everything well. And I will check uh, really thoroughly everything. All the chicken is cooked. And I'm going to put chili pepper, one teaspoon, and black pepper, half spoon. So now it looks, smells so good. So this is um, Chicken, what do you say? Chicken stew, or what did I say? Stir chicken. Moment of truth, tasting time. First, the sauce. Perfect. And I'm going to taste a little bit of the chicken. Mmm. A little bit zucchini. Wow, this is perfect. Stir chicken or chicken stew. I'm going to eat this chicken together with the pasta tonight. All right, with that, I wish you a great day. Bye.